It's got to be a blended version of learning, blended through traditional face-to-face -face and blended with today's most advanced technology, where you've got a live teacher up on your screen. For, we do Brazilian, Portuguese, Chinese, and Spanish. Our teachers are in China, our teachers are in Brazil, they're in Mexico. They're right up on your screen, so you're getting modern content, you're getting interactive learning content on your screen next to the teacher. It's a blend of the best of the best recordings of all the classes that you can actually send to the student. So if the student says, you know what, I've got a question, I'd like to remember what the teacher was saying. They just click on the link, go to the video, and there's their answer. They know exactly what the teacher was talking about that day. It has to be customizable to the students to fit the needs. That's a common theme in my talk and in my paper. It has to be what they need to learn about or they're not going to learn. It has to fit to the language. That's another problem that Rosetta and Berlitz have is they took one system that was built, I think Berlitz was built for French or German back in 1878, and then they applied it to every other language on the planet. You can't learn, you don't learn Mandarin the same way you learn German or French. It's impossible. They're two totally separate languages. They have no relation to each other. So it's a blending of technology, and that's what the term that we came up with was blend tech education.